Hi guys and welcome to my living room. So because of the pandemic, um, I haven't been able to have people over and see the apartment that we've moved into. Um, so I'll go over um, what my living room looks like and where I got all the stuff. Now, again, it was in the middle of the pandemic, so most of our stuff was from Target. But here's a peek. So here's one angle of the living room. Um, I'll make the angle differently um, later, but I'm just gonna explain this side first. Um, and I apologize if it's a little dark, um, just because it's winter time, so it's not the brightest outside either. But I will say that um, this apartment actually gets a lot of natural lighting during the summer and even during the winter time when the sun is out as well. So um, when you walk in to the unit, um, if our windows are open for the bedroom and the living room, it's a bunch of natural lighting, which I love. Okay, so I got these couches from um, an outlet. Um, in one of my hometowns where you can just pay up front and take a home that same day. Originally, I was going to get a set like this uh, through Slumber Slumberland, but um, it was going to take months to get here. And with the pandemic too, the delivery times were even longer. So no, so we just, when you know it's our first apartment so we're just gonna go with these and these couches were under a thousand dollars for sure uh and it included all these pillows and i think there's one in the corner hiding as well but all of these pillows included with it all right so now we got the coffee table also from target um we ordered it and it came in pretty fast but it was a little dented it's all metal very heavy duty um but i really wanted a coffee table that had a second level shelf underneath there um as you can see there's a bunch of games in there um, because we really enjoy doing board games with our friends and family uh and then you can see the nerf guns that i got my husband for uh christmas this past year um, and yeah, they're sitting there because sometimes we just go full on brawl. Now, it's kind of hard to see, but on my coffee table, I've got candles from um, mostly Target. Um, we also have a stash of candles from friends as gifts when we first moved in. Um, but otherwise, we've also got the uh, tissue box um, as well as, you can't really see it, but um, right there is uh, some coasters and it took us the longest time to get some coasters but we really needed those coasters it's like a must-have okay and then on the floor um, you can see our carpet um, I believe it's a 9 foot by 12 foot uh, carpet that we got from Target it was about $200 I believe and it's the really fluffy kind but after having used it and yeah, I, I just would not recommend it. It was great when we first had it, but I wouldn't recommend it. I probably won't bring it with us if we were to move later. So if you could kind of tell, I'm trying to go with this light gray, cream, whitish, and black theme. Um, and so you can see, if I'm pointing correctly, okay, right here, um, all of my stuffed animals and his stuffed animals. Uh, from carnivals, we love carnivals and festivals. Um, and then uh, another throw blanket that I got from Target. Okay, so in that back corner, I've got a lamp that was also from Target. I don't remember how much it was because um, the husband had picked that one out. <laughs> um, but we love it, we do love it. Um, it is very bright, um, enough for our apartment, at least just for us. And then we have a small uh, end table. It does come in a set, but okay, so I had wanted the set, it's from Target. Um, I think it was like 30 or $40 for a set of two, um, but I found it for, I think, 
$10 or $5? Five or $10 from Goodwill. And I only needed one. I didn't want two because originally in this corner, on this side of the couch was my husband's gaming bean chair couch. <laughs> so, so I only needed one just to hold um, the internet box, whatever you call that. Um, so it's small. Okay, originally I wanted a nice end table where it had like a drawer so I could hide, hide things, you know, but um, you know, most of these end tables come in sets. And so I was just like, oh, let's just wait. Let's just, I'm gonna wait it out. We don't need, need it, but it, it'd be helpful. And we were so lucky. Um, okay, most of the time I'm not lucky, but my husband's really lucky. And so when we were at Goodwill, we were just like thrifting because I, I like to thrift. And then usually we, we look at the clothes and he was like, let's go look over there where the furniture is. Like, let's just, let's just go look. And I'm like, okay, fine. Boom, there was the end table. Okay, for a cheap price. I didn't have to buy the set because I, I only needed one. And you know, solution to my problem, oh, so happy when I went home. So definitely go check thrift stores um and try to save your money okay so then in that corner um i'll have another video for this that i will have to do with my husband because i don't know all of the information which i know this category a population of people will want to know um but basically that's all of our anime stuff over there um so figurines figurines still in the boxes like a collection that my husband and i like love to collect i could say my end stuff but he's also got quite a bit of stuff that i will not know their names of so that will be in another video and I'll try to link that below when we do make that video. I also do have a couple portable speakers in that corner on that end table shelf, um, but they're more decorative than they are um, being used. Um, and they were given as gifts. All right, and then just one more thing before I change the angle of the living room. I don't know if you can see it very well, but hanging right here, on top of these shades is these star and moon lights that I had found um, on an article, I think, uh, through social media or something. And I thought it was super cute. It was super cheap too. Um, I think it's under $20, but I don't know for sure. Um, it did take quite a while before they came in, um, but I love them. And they have different settings as well. I'll have to show you that. All right, so I closed the blinds just so that you can see it. See the stars and the moonlights. And then, so you could also see the um, floor lamp from Target and see how bright that is. Uh, but these ones, I usually just leave it on one setting because it's kind of annoying to me when it's twinkling, but there's multiple different settings. Now, I just got the simple yellow light color, but it also comes in a multicolor. Okay, for real this time, this is the last thing um, that I forgot to mention. In that corner, um, it used to be on this side, but we had to move it during Christmas season to make some room. Okay, it's a big circle metal, uh, throw pillow and throw blanket uh, basket, which I love. Wow, that's where the extra pillow that I was talking about is sitting in. Um, and then I don't have too many throw blankets, so sometimes I'll throw in there, but I'm cold most of the time, so I, I just need my throw blanket like right there, so. Okay, so here's the other angle of the living room. As you can see, this was the other side that we talked about. Um, and then this is just a couple more things in our living room. So yes, we don't have a TV stand yet. So here's the story about that. Okay, so I don't know too much about technical 
computerized, like electronic type stuff. So I was like, okay, hon, you gonna have to um, do your research and figure out which TV you want because you're gonna be the one playing games on it and I don't do all this. Like, I just watch Netflix. And that's it. So, so I love that job to him. The only job, everything else, I was like, I'll take care of it. This is how I want to decorate my apartment. And that was his job. So obviously we got the TV. It's a 65 inch TV from Target. Um, that's the best I can explain to you. Uh, so um, in terms of specs, I can't tell you anything else. So with a bigger TV, we have a little bit of hard time of finding a TV stand that we really like, or at least that I like. I don't know what he's doing on his end yet, but uh, yeah, we have been looking. Uh, we're halfway through our yearly, so we're kind of, we're okay. We're, this, we don't mind too much, you know, that it's on the floor and stuff, um, but, I don't know, we're also kind of thinking maybe when we move out or have our own place or something, we'll just mount it. Cause I think that's that's just the thing right now. But yeah, I don't know. I don't know, but that's how it is right now. And then obviously you can see his switch. Um, and I'm hoping to plan to um, show you some more reactions when we're playing Mario Kart or something. Um, so look out for that video as well. But anyways, um, my love, right here is this mirror from Ikea okay this mirror is like approximately I think a little over a hundred dollars or something I don't remember you'll have to look at that too okay but this was in the middle of the pandemic so their store was not open and we had to go get it uh, like pick it up otherwise shipping is expensive I do not recommend shipping. Either go drive out there and get it yourself or like just wait until this pandemic is over. Okay, so originally I was going to get a smaller version of this mirror that one of my friends had, okay? But online, it, it looks the same, right? I'm not reading the measurements either, right? I was like, oh, it looks the same. It's available, yeah. <laughs> so, we go pick it up. My husband and I go pick it up in my little sedan, Nissan Altima. And we had to go back home. We had to go back home and switch cars so that he could drive his Honda Civic, um, not Honda Civic, Honda CRV. Okay, to go pick it up. And miraculously, it fit. Okay, I'm sitting. It was dangerous, okay? Because I was in the passenger seat and the mirror's at an angle and I'm scooched all the way up to the airbags, like up to that windshield as far as it could go because this mirror barely fit in that car because it was that big. Um, I don't know what the specs are, but it's tall, way taller than me. Um, we left. I'm gonna angle it here. We left this uh, cardboard on those two ends right here because um, it's very sharp. The metal part is very sharp. It's uh, really padded when it comes in that packaging. So it's, it's pretty safe, um, but it is heavy. You will need some help carrying. So I love it. Um, it does get dusty in here, so, you know, Windex and paper towels. But um, otherwise, we put a regular little bathroom mat on the bottom just so it doesn't mess up the hardwood, hardwood? Hardwood floor. Um, and that we just got from Target as well. Uh, just super simple and then on the corners there is just artwork one that I did and then one from my brother um, Yeah, so I'm gonna angle it one more time Now we used to have all that anime stuff on the shelf and then we had to move it because of Christmas and so It just stayed there since 
Um, but basically this is where we like drop our keys and everything. And then here we've got um, a photo frame of my husband and I, and then a little art thing uh, that says home that I made. Um, and then I just have like a little music box um, that I have sitting in front of there that I got from an anime convention. What's it called? I don't remember, I'm sorry. I only went to one. Um, and then the pandemic happened, so uh, I don't remember what it's called, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that concludes my living room tour.